What's up guys, War here, welcome back to the channel. So today I have some disturbing news and this is a bummer for everybody. So patch notes just got released and everything's getting nerfed. Let's check it out. Okay guys, so we are back here uh, on the official Blizzard website where they released some patch notes. Must have happened sometime yesterday or last night. But we are going to go over this. I briefly looked over it because I was like, is it minor? Is it major? It's pretty major. So Diablo 4, the guys over at Blizzard released a patch notes that are... It's platform wide. It's on absolutely everything. And they've just made a lot of adjustments to the classes and wanted to provide their reasoning. Overall, they're happy with the performance of classes, but there's always room for improvement. As always, we want players to both feel and truly, you know, both feel and be truly powerful. Some class builds and synergies are out of our bounds for what's reasonable. Some skills and builds are not as effective. And then Paragon Glyphs currently providing too much player power so let's take a look man i mean this is kind of crazy so if you guys are playing certain builds you might want to change them now so starting with barbarian the challenging shot the damage got reduced or the damage reduction gained is in uh for skill ranks with juice from four percent to two percent that really sucks the legendary aspect blood chieftain the cooldown was uh, reduced down and then aspect of the dire whirlwind the crit strike damage has been reduced it looks like they pretty much nerfed everything Item changes. These are some item changes for the Whirlwind uh, that got reduced as well. And then some explosion damage got reduced. Uh, then over to my Precious Druid that I'm playing. Pulverize Lucky Hit got reduced. Pulverize has been an absolute slapper from the get. Now, I do want to dabble in some Lightning Storm since the damage got increased. Grizzly Rage uh, damage increased, which is really cool. The Obsidian Slam um, class specialization got um, increased from 10 to 20, which kind of sucks. But uh, Lucky Hit chance reduced. Electric Shock, um, it looks like they did a lot of changes with Druid. The Legendary Aspect changes uh, got reduced. Critical Strike damage reduced. It's almost like they nerfed absolutely everything. Flat damage increased for Lightning Dancer, but like who uses that, you know? Uh, Necromancer, Blood Lance, damage increased. I still don't think this is going to change Blood Lance. They got to do something else to it. Army of the Dead, damage increased from 30% to 45%. They're like... I think they're trying to buff Necro to change it away from Bone Spear, but the fact is Bone Spear is still the best. Uh, Blood Wave, I like this. This is a good ultimate. Shadow Blight, damage increase. See, they're buffing everything to Necro. Grim Harvest. We knew this was coming, ladies and gentlemen. We knew it. Okay, Serration, uh, Critical Strike Chance reduced. That's okay, though. Um, Essence Gain, which is insane. Uh, Death's Defense, mi maximum minion life loss in a single damage has been reduced this i mean the, the minions need to be able to stay alive raised skeleton warrior attack damage increased golem attack damage increased uh blood golem damage increased and then healing which is really good iron golem which is even better uh necromancer paragon boards the golem life changes have all been buffed they literally nerfed the barbarian and druid so far and they 100 buffed the the necro so shout out to all you necromans let's go over to rogue because i'm going to tell you guys right now that twisting blades has been literally the front line of the game since release so advanced twisted blades cooldown reduce enemy per hit from 0.25 to 0.1 that's literally nothing advanced twisted blade cooldown reduced from three to two seconds so that's okay but this nothing man rapid fire they want you to go more range damage reduction uh from 0.8 to 0.4 that really sucks so they're moving twisting or like rogue to plot be more a little bit more ranged instead of melee damage uh crit strike from damage from dash is okay damage from caltrops increased yeah they almost want you to play a little bit more control ranged with uh with the rogue which kind of is just kind of sucks man because twisted plates is insane um uh, maximum minion loft it lost damage all right let's take out check out sorcerer guys arc lash lucky hit oh my god you knew they were gonna nerf uh arc lash because arc lash chain lightning is just too powerful uh teleport damage reduction reduced from five seconds three seconds is still okay uh, bonus damage reduced. God, man, they're just nerfing everything. And then we got some general stuff. Druid companions and necro companions. Uh, minions. Here we go. Maximum damage over time taken reduced. Okay, this is good. Paragon nodes. Player attack speed nodes reduced by 50. Yikes. All glyph bonuses scaling has been reduced by 34% except for the following. Oh, my God. Look at all the nerfs. Look at all the nerfs to the glyphs. Significant reduce the spawn of treasure goblins in PvP zones. Holy crap, guys. I don't know what you guys think, but everything got absolutely nerfed except for the Necromancer. So shout out to you, Necromancer mains. I'm going to have to change my entire Druid build to the Lightning Storm. Great. I'm really excited to play that. 
Uh, but yeah, guys, this release, I wanted to bring this to you as quickly and as fast as possible, guys. So like the video, let me know what guys, what you think about all the nerfs down in the description below. We are literally three days in to the launch of Diablo 4 and they're already doing a massive, massive nerf. So let me know what you guys think down in the comments and make sure to subscribe if you guys are new. We're almost at 10K, holy crap, we're almost there. And as always, stay gaming. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.